Hi, we are going to tell you about how to access your child's Google Classroom. So this is an example of what it will look like when they open it on their Chromebook. And this is the stream page. And if you scroll down on the stream page, you can see that assignments are posted. Sometimes teachers may use it as a message board for homework or other uh, messages to parents. Um, also, many times on Google Classroom, parents think they could actually see grades. Most teachers do not post grades of the assignments on Google Classroom, but instead post those on Illuminate. So we're gonna go now to Mrs. Basili. She's gonna to talk to you about the classwork. Okay, so once you're in your child's Google Classroom, you can click on classwork and there's pretty much two different ways it might be organized. This classroom is organized by date and sort of holds a running record for the whole year. Other teachers might organize by topic. So you might see areas like math, reading, and things like that. So if a child is looking for something, they'll either need to know the topic or approximately when, when it was assigned or what it might be called. You can also see here, you can see all the topics in this drop down menu, which might be dates depending on the classroom. Anything your child has submitted, if you click on view your work at the top, you can see work that was submitted. Sometimes there might be due dates, sometimes there aren't. It just depends on the assignment and how the teacher collected it. You can also tell if something's been turned in or not. So if something's been turned in, it will say turned in here on the right. If it says assigned, that means it hasn't been turned in, but possibly something in person was. What they want to go through and do sometimes just to maybe stay organized is look through and see, did I complete that? And if so, I might want to go in and turn it in. It will typically say over here on the right, turn in, or it might say the word submit. Once that is turned in, if they need to make a change to one of these Google Docs, they will have to unsubmit the assignment, make their changes, and then turn it in again. So most teachers are pretty flexible unless there is a hard due date that needs to be adhered to. Besides classwork, the only other super important thing to know with Google Classroom is parents, unfortunately, you do not have access to this on your own. You can only see it if you go through your child's Google Classroom, which they would have to go through their Clever to get here. What you can do is you can be matched as a guardian into your child's Google Classroom, but that will just give you an occasional guardian report on completed work. So as Mrs. Fissler mentioned with grades, you'll wanna make sure you check Illuminate. Thank you so much and let your teachers know if you have any other questions.